Good morning, everyone. Do you like my smiley face cardigan? It's smiling, so I don't have to. Uh. So, uh, I'm tired. It's what, the fourth? We're going into the fourth week of the semester here. <sighs> I did not sleep well last night because when I got home from work, I decided it was a good idea to like eat all of the salt, all of the nachos, just right in, right in. It was too much. And so now I'm definitely feeling it. I feel like the nachos are like right here. They didn't want to ever go down to the intestinal tract. And so all night I was just like, where's the water? So I think I drank like three or four bottles of water last night <laughs> instead of sleeping, which meant I was also going to the bathroom a lot and I'm just so thirsty. <laughs> it's definitely a food hangover. It feels exactly like a hangover hangover, except from food instead of poison aka alcohol. Anyways, I'm going to be filming a first impression for you with a product that I'm very excited about. And I feel like my channel has been all about the under eye concealer first impressions. I'm sorry, I just, I like testing them, I guess. <laughs> oh, I really, I feel like I'm gonna puke. Oh, this next one that I'm gonna be trying out. Ding, ding, ding. So excited! It's the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Eraser Dark Circles Treatment Concealer with Goji Berry and Haloxyl. That's exciting! When I was picking this up in the store, I had no idea which shade to get. I really didn't. I got the one light pale. I know it's supposed to be like pal or French or something, but that just reads pale to me. The other ones were really, really dark and I'm not really, really dark. And the one that was like the corrective color looked way too pink, like way too pink. So I got this one. Uh, everyone seems to love this thing. And I think it really speaks to the artist in me. Just the thought of being able to just the dark circles away. This says it's gonna instantly erase dark circles, fine lines, visibly, visibly diminish puffiness. Let's just try it out, shall we? I already put on foundation to speed up the process here. All right, here it is. I'm really excited even just to be holding this. <laughs> it's like meeting a celebrity. Take the cap off. Ah! I've wanted to touch this for years! <laughs> so, as I'm sure you're all very familiar, it's got the little spongy... Eee, it feels as wonderful as I thought it would. Perverts of the world are probably gonna get way too much out of this screen shot. I'm gonna make a gif of that, hey. It comes with 0.2 fluid ounces. Looks like a lot more than that, but okay. I just want to rub this on my everything. Don't be weird. Let's see. Turn collar of the micro corrector applicator in direction of arrows until product is visible on sponge. This may require a number of turns. Adjust accordingly for desired amount of product. Using applicator, apply concealer directly to under eye area, blending in an outward motion. To apply more, twist collar of applicator one to two clicks at a time. Best results, use sparingly. I think that was a good explanation, Maybelline. I think you did well there. Okay, so let's find out how many twists. Galileo is watching in anticipation too right over here. We got some! And seriously, when I'm saying this pale color is really dark looking, I'm actually very scared to put this underneath my eyes. It might work. Wow, Maybelline. Color selection, please. Let's get you zoomed in here. Can you see me? Me and my sad, not filled in eyebrows. Yay. So I'm blind. I hope you can see. All right, so I'm just gonna do as they do. All right. Oh yeah, 
I'll use sparingly. Okay. Oh, got it on my nose. Alright, it's really smooth. It's really, really lightweight. Seriously, feather light. It's really nice. Um, I think it provides good coverage. Surprisingly. I don't know why that's surprising. <laughs> uh, it's the nachos. Alright, I think that's good. Do you? What do we think? You like it? Wow. I think it looks really nice, you guys. Uh, but I, I tend to think that about these things when I first apply them. So I guess I'm just gonna finish putting on the rest of my makeup. You want a little speed through? I can I can do that for you guys. Anything for you, boo thang. <laughs> is done okay so we've got some initial creasing can we see the creasing that's happening I'm used to it even with my number one under eye concealer fake up it does that there's initial creasing and then you rub it away and then you're good and voila so I'm gonna go see if I can sort this out whatever's going on today get some actual not pajama clothes on and I guess I will be right back ready for the magic transition ding so I'm running late <laughs> what's new I need to go like 10 minutes ago so uh yeah I just don't have time to talk it's currently 9 34 in the morning technically I put on this concealer about an hour ago so about 8 30 in the morning so I'm gonna go to my first job and then I'll check back with you afterwards so uh see you then okay bye <laughs> I've got on my cat shorts, which must mean that I'm back home, right? Don't you do that when you get home? You put on your PJ shorts? No? Okay. All right. Well, just me, I guess. I'm excited. I'm home a little bit earlier than I usually would be. It's currently 1.31 in the afternoon. I think this is a good time to check out the situation I got going on under my eyes. Wouldn't you say? Nod your head with me, people. Oh, yeah. I liked that. Ooh. I think it looks good when I'm not doing this, like I demonstrated last time. And you see under this eye especially, it just, it doesn't look super duper cute. Ooh. 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 Weird. Okay, so it creased really bad under one eye, but not underneath the other. I don't know what happened. That's life. That's life. That's what all the people say. Otherwise, I mean, I think it looks good. A lot better than some of the other ones I've been trying. It's really moisturizing. Like, it still feels creamy. And my under eyes feel really silky. 
which I'm definitely not used to. I've got very dry under eye bags, so that's nice. Anyways, I'm just gonna putz around until I have to go to work. I've got some laundry to put away and I wanna get some reading done for my classes. If I could take a nap, that would be nice. We'll see. I also need food. I haven't eaten yet today. After the nacho talk this morning, it was, I wasn't feeling food until about a couple hours ago and then I needed food and I still haven't gotten food because I was busy teaching. So, enough rambling. I'm gonna do those things and I guess I will just check up with you guys soon. The power of movies. Lots of time will pass, like many hours, but it'll only be a second here on YouTube. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, I think um, that nap should take priority. Good night <laughs> for now. But I'm not, I'll see you soon. Hello, good evening. I am home from work. I'm so ready for bed. <laughs> oh, it's been a long day. It is 9.53 in the evening. So I suppose, when did I put this on? 8.30? So it's been well over 12 hours. I can't do math right now, you guys. Uh, 13, 13 and a half hours almost. All right, you know, the creasing isn't awful. I'm gonna give it that. Especially compared to a lot of the concealers I've been trying out lately. Do you see the creasing? That's not bad. It looks like the concealer stayed on. I mean, in this light, these are just the literal dents in my face. There's nothing we can do about that, but... Oh, my under eye is really soft. The concealer didn't, like, dry. I mean, it's not, like, wet or anything, but, like, it still feels, like, really smooth and nice, soft to the touch. I would say this is a good drugstore under eye concealer. I could also see this working well on blemishes. I think some people do use it for that. I still think my Benefit Fake Up holds the number one position, but I think this is a good one. I'll be able to use this one up. I hope you're all well. I hope you enjoyed the review as always. And I guess just until next time, just stay well until then. Someone just took a poopy.